Hey gang, I'm doing a new intro for this video. We work on the Fast and Furious right here in the middle. And I'm thinking it's gonna be a really, really big, horrible ordeal today. And I really just needed to change the BIOS settings. I guess they didn't save the last time I changed the battery. So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do the BIOS settings after you change the battery. Stick around. First one is the one with the bad computer that we looked at the other day. So all of these are gonna start having problems if we don't you know, attend to them very soon. So trying to do that now, but you know how it is working in an arcade. There's tons of things to do. So this one, when it boots up, it doesn't boot, but let's take a look. Sorry, hopefully I remember to edit that out. All right, so it says floppy disk fail, so it's looking for a floppy disk, and then it gives us some commands on what we can do. We can hit F8 to get into the system config, and then we can hit F9 to, what is it, select a boot device, or, yeah. And F1 would just be to skip everything and go ahead and play the game. So what I need to do is go get a com or go get a computer. I need to get a keyboard, and I did set us up a uh, USB extension that is popping out right here to the coin door, so we can sit in the front of the game and work, which is very handy if you have to do this. And hopefully, the last time I worked on this, you know, maybe I, I forgot to hit save after I redid all my settings, and hopefully that's the only problem because uh, it looks like it just didn't save the settings. There were some way worse errors I had thought before. I thought something was in red and thought it said like, I don't know, kill, switch or something. I don't remember what it, what it was. But stick around, I'm gonna get this keyboard and get it set up and hopefully we can fix it in this episode. No signal. All right, let me turn the computer on. Forgot about that. But if the settings aren't saving, and I have a feeling it's the keyboard we're using. There's our computer. PC, whatever you want to call it. F8 to enable system configura configuration. F9 to select boot device. I know F1 worked. Nothing for F8, nothing for F9. Normally you have to hold delete while you turn it on. Maybe we have to do that, I guess. I can't get this to work. Yeah, that's all it gives me. Delete to hit. Delete to enter setup. That would work. Okay, okay. Never mind. BIOS settings. Yeah. You need to power on after shutdown. Boot sequence of floppy disk, you need that too. No, 
this one should be hard to see. Okay, so I moved it down, enter, and select. I wonder if this will work if I can disable it. I guess we're going to find out. Who other device? I'm going to leave that one on, but I'm going to turn this one off because we don't have it. Okay, now how do we save? F10. Okay, we have to save and exit. We're still gonna have to come back through and do the power management settings, if that even works. doesn't work, I'm going to check the battery and then we'll start over. We got another 10 minute wait. Prepare for some Cindy Lopper. on we know it's not going to power up on so on its own so how will we oh we'll know if it just boots after i turn the computer on though. so we will have some clues if it does that then i'll be excited this is almost like a non-video She works. Give me a second and I'll turn it off. Actually, I'll turn it off and then I'll, I'll turn, as we come back, I'll have it booting up. Prepare for some Cindy Lopper. It's hot in here today. to go. All right. Yay. This really tells us nothing. Else. And then even if I turn it off and turn
things went just like I thought. I just booted it up, holding the delete key, and we went right to the BIOS menu. So now we want to go down to power management. And power on by alarm. Turn on so the pen is down. Power on function. Power power on after power fail. That's what we want. It says off. Enter. We want that to go to former state. And now we want to save F10. Make sure there's nothing else we want. Fingers crossed it boots. So right to the This is different, huh? Mouse click, mouse top key, password. <laughs> hey! Hey! Hey with the Fonzie. I don't know if that's going to help us or not. Let's go with F10. Alright, so one more trip. Now I have to hold the yes. delete button to get into the menu. So I'll have you hold the delete button. Okay. And then uh, I'm going to go ahead and let it boot up. I don't want it to do its thing all the way by itself. We can give it a little call. So now I'm going to wait for it to boot all the way through this again. So, so I'll I'll just, when I come back, I'm just going to have it off. And then we'll see if it comes up by itself. It made it past that screen again, right? Get in your hole, okay, yeah, we'll be right back. All right. Only a 50 seconds. This is the moment of truth. Hopefully it just comes on by itself. It's so it's just, it's I guess I didn't save it last time. time. All it really needed, but for whatever reason, I guess I didn't get the right. Save button. We'll see if it comes on. I thought we were going to have other on, but it looks really, really nice. I have to take a little face or so. That's on, right? I didn't see no signal. Yes. That's it. There's a repair sheet back there. I think it said the. Motherboard was replaced in 17, no, in 16. So I was 17, the hard drive was replaced. Boots up. Yeah. 18, 18 or 19, the hard drive was replaced. And then I'll show you that. Yeah, 2020, they replaced my like. old computer. I don't know that I've ever seen a new one. There she is, on her own. Well, it's not new. Now we just got to get to the boot up on its own. So I'm going to, uh, what is this? Uh, 2004 game. Wow. I didn't think it was that old. Uh, I guess it is the first Fast and Furious. The fat and curious. That's cool though. I thought we were gonna have to pull the computer. Still have to look at this fourth one down here and check its computer. I'm assuming they need uh, just some love. We'll get in there, give them some maintenance. I have the backs off all of them, and I'm going to put some uh, box fans back there. Probably one on either end, just to blow on the backs of all these games. Need to get in there, like blow the computers out with the power or with the air compressor and the power supplies with the air compressor. Get all that wool dust off of there. All right, come on, come on. I don't think I've ever played this one in a video. Played Drift. That well, looks positive. Yeah. All right. So that's one last thing now. I don't, I don't like the, whoever's working the counter to have to come in. There's certain games that they have to coin up. Um, there's certain games that have to be turned off, turned back on, like RoboCop and Frogger. But this one, they had to come in and put a keyboard up into the um, box over here to get it into gameplay. And then that's a little bit uh, too high tech for some of them. So that's one less thing that I have to worry about happening. But let's uh, move around to the back of the machine and uh, take a look in there. So here's a freshened up PC. See, uh, I don't know if I can get a good look at that video card. But everything's new in there, the hard drive's new. 
Wiring all looks new, nowhere near as much dust. As you can see, the fans blowing for uh, the motherboard and for the video card. This was running a little hot. Seems to be fine now. But yeah, I think that'll, that'll work for that one. So this video is gonna be about setting the BIOS settings. <laughs> Hopefully I remember to tell you in the beginning. Uh, I think that'll be it for this one. We'll just call it a BIOS settings video and we'll move on to the next one. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. These two right here are gonna be ground and five volt. So what do we get here? Did I not turn the game on? I didn't turn the game on. I guess that would help. Hang on. Here it is. A nice little trade. The person I traded got what they wanted. I got what I wanted. And a pretty good deal on it, too. So I hang on. Get what I want. <laughs> <laughs> that comes later. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's, it's on fire. What happened? Whoa. Lots of smoke. Well, that's bad. Yeah, well, thanks for watching. <laughs> when you take care of people, people take care of you in this community. That's the truth. So everyone, please remember that. Even if we're competitors, we're not enemies.